hey guys so it's the start of the seventh weekly vlog um and i'm just currently like exporting the other weekly vlog number six um it is currently 20 past three so it's not the morning um i've been house hunting this morning um in manchester just for like next year's house and stuff like that um and yeah so just having like a weird day really like it's just been like i don't know like a a weird day we're doing loads of different things uh me and my friend claire are about to do some like uni work um but we're about to like basically make something you can't show it in case it looks bad okay well no we've got to show it it'll just be hilarious okay, um we'll make it pretty and then you can show it okay we're making like a prototype for like a project that we're doing basically for like a business idea and it's all to do with like makeup and makeup storage so we're making that like not actually making it we're making it out of cardboard and like painting it and stuff so like that we can show it in the like basically in the presentation so that's what we're about to do we're about to go to like a shop and buy some paint and some glue and basically make something basically like we're back in like year one at school or something that's ridiculous <laughs> so we will definitely show you it when it's done even though it looks absolutely horrendous uh, but i just want to say hey and start the weekly vlog so this is mine and claire's finished prototype and can we just appreciate how amazing this is you have to show it from the side. yeah literally we have made this out of nothing literally out of cardboard it was out of a feel unique box um, you have to show and this look this is out of a mcdonald's cup where's the other mcdonald's cup that we've got did we put it um, in the bin yeah it's in the bin oh well, you can put it in the bin but anyway yeah this is a mcdonald's cup and then we've got some makeup palettes in here nice bit of organization and then at the front we've got a little phone holder to watch your makeup tutorials on as you're doing your makeup look how cool this is and even fits in an iphone 6 plus so yeah can we just appreciate it? and we've got like a fake pretend mirror down here it's just the best thing in the entire world we're very very proud of ourselves hey guys so it's now tuesday no thursday why do i always do that every single time it's now a thursday morning um and i've just got this dress on which is like quite dressy for uni but i'm meeting my dad after uni um he's uh, up in manchester for like work today um so i'm meeting him we're gonna go for dinner so i thought if i'm going straight after uni i was like i'll just wear something nice so i'm wearing this dress and i'll just wear a coat over the top um I just wanted to say how nice the comments on the weekly vlog have been like in the past like however since it went up last night at like six o'clock they've been so lovely you guys are so nice and they're just every comment's been like the loveliest comment and like i don't know it's just made me really really happy you all saying like how much you love them and stuff like that it's just i don't know it's just really really nice so thank you very much i really appreciate those um i what time is it 20 past seven and i'm just watching emily Callum's vlogs which i absolutely love i'm like obsessed with um and yeah so this morning i just need to brush my hair and dry it i think we'll have porridge for breakfast i'm pretty sure i really fancy porridge i haven't had porridge in such a long time i used to have it at home a lot I haven't had it in ages, so I think I'm going to have porridge for breakfast with some mashed banana, because I can't have it without mashed banana in it, um, and some raisins, and maybe some, um, like, frozen raspberries, like, defrosted, so then they go warm and nice. Um, so, yeah, that's what I'm going to have for breakfast. So, it is a hell of a lot later, and I have had a very, very, very strange day. Um, I just thought I'd, like, catch up with you. It's now half past nine, um, on, what day is it, Thursday and basically i went to uni this morning and oh, this camera so right now i went to uni this morning and i was okay when i woke up and then i just started to become really upset and like i don't know just really like i was just really upset and like emotional and teary and stuff anyway I went to uni and then i got to uni got to uni late because my car was so iced up blah 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 and anyway got to uni and went to my seminar i couldn't sit with my friends because i got there late so i like basically just had to sit on the spare seat and anyway I, the seminar was fine i was still feeling a bit upset and emotional but is this in focus because this camera has really got an issue at the moment <laughs> anyway and um yeah i couldn't sit with my friends and at the end of the seminar um my seminar tutor basically just turned around like because i'd like emailed about the fact that i wasn't there because of like, my granddad and said the past couple of weeks and he was like how are you dealing with it and i was just like yeah okay like obviously didn't want to like, tell him too much and then he was like asking all of these questions like really personal questions about my granddad and like what happened and stuff i literally just burst into tears i was like like it just wasn't nobody has asked me those type of questions because nobody has been like in not insensitive i think he was quite trying to be nice and he was just trying to you know, ask questions and stuff but like nobody's asked me those questions and then for your seminar tutor to ask you those questions literally i was just i literally just broke down 
Um, I was really upset, so I came home because I literally like, there was nowhere I could stay at uni. And it sounds ridiculous, but like literally it was just awful. And um, I don't know. And then literally I was just really, really, really down for the rest of the day. Really upset. I was just thinking about my granddad and. It was just really difficult. So that's been my day basically. Um, but really nice tonight. My dad's been in Manchester because he's been on business. So we went out for dinner and that was really lovely. I really enjoyed seeing it. It was really, really nice. So um, yeah, we did that and that was lovely. Just having a little catch up together and stuff. Um, and it just made me in like a much better mood. So, oh, my battery's dying. <laughs> um, it just made me in a much better mood. So I've had a really weird day and I'm okay now. I'm absolutely fine now. Um, and um, also I've come on today as well for anybody that wants a bit of TMI info um, so just the whole thing combined was just not good I literally had the worst pains like I just get horrendous like pains in the time of the month um, like before I'm coming out I just get them horrendously so I was like oh it was awful and then I just had a bang headache it was just not good so um, yeah that's been me today basically a bit weird a bit mismatched and that's just been it really Morning everyone, um, so this morning I have woken up with a slight sif sniffly nose and sore throat and only really slight and anybody else would just be like oh it'll go, I'm so like conscious and like on it I'm like no I'm going to have a lamp sip, <laughs> um, so I'm going to have a lamp sip in a second um, because well I just, I always keep them in like my drawers just in case because I'm just like I don't know if I just don't feel well then I just don't want to not have lens it. Does that make sense? I don't I just always want to have it on hand. Um so I am just about to go and have one. I think it's just me all over. If I like feel even slightly ill, I'm like, yeah, I need one right now. It needs to go. Um because we're going out tonight as well for Christina's birthday. Um I think this morning we're going to sign over to a house for next year um, and it's a bit of a long story so I will explain that to you later but that's what I'm doing this morning I'm in a bit of a rush so I should probably go and just get ready because I've got like 45 minutes to do my makeup do my hair and get some breakfast so so I'm sorry about the weird lighting situation you're probably thinking Jess why are we in the car and the reason for that is my day has gone very skew basically. Bradley rang me and went, Jess, my car won't start. I was like, all right, okay. This was yesterday. And I was like, he was like, oh, it's fine, it's fine. And I was like, what the hell? And he was like, I think it might be the petrol. Because Bradley always leaves his car like right to the bottom until the petrol is basically got nothing left in it. Um, which is just horrendous. You should never do that, guys. Just a little life lesson. Um, so he was like, the, I think it might be the petrol. Anyway, got a petrol canister, filled it up, put it in his car. It still won't start. Um, and so basically, we think it's the battery. And his parents have said it's probably the battery as well. Um, so basically if you're young and don't know what this means but basically you've got like jumper car so it means like you have to basically use my my battery in my car to start bradley's battery back in his car if that makes sense um so i'm currently driving to derby to jump bradley's car <laughs> um because he says he's coming here tonight to go out for christina's birthday like he's not just going out like everybody else is going out for a birthday how weird would that be just like bradley partying in by herself um anyway yeah so we're all going out tonight and he was like well i really want to come whatever and um so i'm currently now just leaving my house to drive to bradley's to go and help him jump his car and i'm driving straight back to manchester because bradley needs to go to uni so he won't drive back with me straight away like i'll drive back and then he'll come if that makes sense so yeah it should be interesting you know it should be an interesting situation but hopefully it will work and all will be absolutely fine so that's what i'm doing basically my day was supposed to be filled with doing productive uni work and instead it's filled with jumping bradley's car for him um but at the, end, at the end of the day it's not his fault in the entire in the size it's like we've all said it's probably because of the cold because it's just been freezing here at the moment it's a bit warmer today it's seven degrees but yesterday it was like minus one like pretty much all day um and that will be probably the reason why it wouldn't start so yeah it's not his fault in the slightest so i'm going i'm just going to get some petrol because i've literally got no petrol i don't want my car to break down on the way do we <laughs> um so yeah i just need to go and get some petrol and then i'm going so that's the plan really it should be quite funny 
please ignore the state of my face i forgot to bring any powder uh, because i like rushed to like bradley's and i literally look awful we got his class started again so to that is fab and then we've just been to asda to get a few bits and bobs for tonight get some alcohol get some like pizzas and stuff like that for like afterward like, like before for our dinner and stuff um because we'll all just have pizzas and stuff and we've got like one of those trays of like 20 donuts that you can get from or i think it's 20 like 15 donuts that you can get from um asda so that was really good my sore throat's coming back <laughs> and um yeah i just would really appreciate not having a sore throat guys i'm so sad right now bradley's behind me and he's got a donut he's eating a donut that's not fair i want a donut right he's just there he's got a donut where's my donut i want one and now i can't have one because i'm driving why don't i get a donut <laughs> so it's now saturday and it's like quarter to six and please ignore this eyebrow it's absolutely huge um it's now like quarter to six in the evening i just haven't been vlogging today not gonna lie um so yeah i just haven't really spoken to you we went out last night and it was okay just me and bradley weren't really in the mood so um yeah so when we came back like we left i don't know got back like about three half three ish and then yeah just went to sleep and stuff and then this morning woke up um and didn't feel too bad to be honest i felt absolutely fine and so did bradley anyway so we were like oh we'll get up and go for a walk and then we were just laying in bed and we were just having like a nice cozy morning um well the whole day really and then we basically i woke up with a cough <coughs> like that i woke up with a cough so i was like for god's sake and i said yesterday didn't i that i was like had like a sore throat and a runny nose so the thing i'm coming down with something i woke up with a cough so that's not really not very good um but I bought, I've, we've just gone to Sainsbury's and I've got some cough medicine. Um, so that's good. So at least, like, my, I don't know, I can, like, get rid of this cough or try and get rid of it. And my nose is getting really sniffly and, like, my throat's not, my throat's not particularly hurting. It's just, like, my nose and my cough, really. Um, so, yeah, we've got some medicine. And then we just went and got a bit of fruit, to be honest, because I really didn't fancy, like, crappy food. Like, Bradley's like, oh, I should get some Pringles or, like, some fish food or, like, Ben Jerry's or whatever. And I was like, no. Oh, by the way, fish food is, like, Ben and Jerry's fish food not fish food um and yeah and i was like no i was like I really don't fancy it i was like, i don't know just fancy like some fruit too but like some plums some passion fruit and what else about cherries so we're just gonna have those and we're gonna have um chinese and like i've just said i don't want to eat bad food but like chinese doesn't make me feel like sluggish like it's chinese I don't know, it doesn't make me feel awful. And like, we're just very, I feel really exhausted. Like, I just feel really shattered. And I've had quite a long sleep, but I just feel like I really just want to get in my pyjamas. And bear in mind, I put this makeup on like half an hour ago. Because basically our plan was to go and get some cough medicine and then maybe pop out for dinner. And then basically we completely changed our mind. And I was like, I'm just too tired. So we've come back. We're not tired, but I just feel like, I just want to be in bed. I think we're going to watch some more of How to Get Away with Murder. Because we started that a couple of weeks ago and it was so good. Um... So I think we're going to watch that, get in my pyjamas and just be so cosy. But I thought I'd just speak to you because I haven't actually spoken to you the whole day. And I felt quite bad. Um, and I didn't speak to you last night either. So I feel like this vlog like from this week hasn't been like too great. Um, but yeah, so I'm not, I don't know, I'm not feeling great to be honest, like in myself. But I think I've just got like a cold and like, I don't know, I feel a bit heady. Like, oh, I don't know. Can we just ignore the state of me? I am really, really not very well. It's now Sunday. Bradley's just left because he's going home um, because Liverpool are playing some final or whatever. Um, so he's going home to watch it with his dad um, because, well, they both support Liverpool. He's like a big football fan. Um, so he's drove home just a second ago and literally I feel horrendous. Like, I feel like I can't, I can hardly speak because like my head's hurting so much. I've got a really bad cough. I'm sat here with Corona next to me, paracetamol. I've got a load of tissues around me and like water and I just feel awful. Um, and I'm not even exaggerating, I literally feel horrendous. Like sometimes you just exaggerate. It's now 25 to 12 and well, I'm just in bed. I'm going to be in bed all day. Um, but I have uni work to do. All I want to do is just go back to sleep or like watch from TV or something. But I have so much uni well not loads of uni work, but it's basically for a presentation. It needs to be done by Tuesday. The presentation is on Thursday, so it's like needs to be done, so I need to get it done. So the whole day today and the whole day tomorrow to get everything sorted. Um 
but I literally feel so ill. So yeah, I don't feel great in the slightest, so that's great, isn't it? There won't be too much vlogging today when I thought unless it's something else. Poor Bradley before he left, I was like, I don't have any Heinz chicken soup, and that's the only thing I like when I'm ill. So he went to the shop and brought me some Heinz chicken soup because literally, well I'm not going out looking like this. Um so yeah, that's that's life really right now. That is life. I'm gonna go and chop up some strawberries because I am peckish, I don't want something too much and it's not quite time for, you know, Heinz chicken soup. So I'm gonna get some strawberries and some cherries and stuff that we bought yesterday and have those first because I feel like I just need some like nutrients. It's literally the first time I've eaten since like eleven o'clock this morning and it's like ten to nine and I'm having some Heinz chicken soup. I feel so awful. <coughs> <coughs> like I feel so 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 much worse. So it's now Monday and I feel awful again. It's like one o'clock and I don't want to like vlog my face because I literally just look horrendous and I haven't washed my hair in like two days. Um, but I've got some pasta and some tuna for lunch because um, I haven't eaten anything all day. So I thought I'd have some of this, see if I could eat it. And I'm just watching one of Alfie's vlogs as well. Um, but yeah, literally have not moved from my bed. I've been doing some uni work, but I'm just really, really feeling awful. Like I literally feel one of the most poorly that I've felt in a long time. Um, so I just wanted to go. I'm having all this medicine and it's not going. So it's now Tuesday and I'm feeling a smidge better, like a tiny bit better. Not loads, but there's an improvement. Um, I just wanted to show you, I've just had this package from M&S, um, or autographed by M&S, which is like their makeup range. And I've just been sent some of the Rosie Huntington um, collection from um, basically... Um, yes. um, and I don't know if you've heard all about it basically, it's all rose gold, it's all really pretty and everybody's gone quite crazy about it so I've been sent some really nice things from there. I've got an eyeshadow palette, a cream blusher, a lipstick, two of the eyeshadow creams and a highlighting palette. So I'm going to get it all out and I'll show you it but it's just come so nicely packaged as well. You just look how pretty this all is, it's so nice. Um, this is the highlighting powder and it's an actual loose powder which I think is mental because and why is it not focusing? I think this is mental that it's a loose powder because I haven't seen it at like a loose highlighter in a very long time. This this is in the colour Rosebud. And it's a really pretty, just iridescent -y, I don't know, normal, pearly shade, really. Um, and I really am really excited to try this. I think it'll be really nice that it's loose. So I've got that. And then I've got this cream blusher. And on the front of all of them, I don't know if you can see just there at the side, but it says Rosy by Autograph. Um, and I've got this cream blusher. I don't want to, like, mess anything up. This is what this one looks like. Look how pretty this is. Such a lovely, lovely shade. Really nice coming up to spring. I love cream blushes in, like, the springtime. Um, then I have this eyeshadow palette, which is so nice. The shades are beautiful. It's slightly different to things that I normally wear, but I do wear like a grey eye quite a lot. And I really like this shade here. It's quite different. Um, so yeah, really like that. Really pretty. Then I have this lipstick here in the colour... What colour is this in? Dolly Baby. Uh, which again is a really nice spring shade. Um, I really like the packaging of the lipsticks. But yeah, it's a really pretty spring shade. I absolutely love lipsticks when they haven't been used at all. It's got this really pretty, pretty flower there on it. But this is so cool because the lid and the lipstick, if I can get it in the right position... Oh, no. This basically clicks, look, which is so satisfying. Like, it's just great. Um, anyway, and then I have two of the eyeshadow sticks, which look beautiful. So I've swatched the eyeshadow sticks for you because they wouldn't focus. But the first one is Almond Eyes, and the second one is Movie Star Crush. And they're so pretty. Honestly, they're so nice. Um, so yeah, I'm really grateful for all of this stuff. So thank you, m and for sending me these bits and pieces. I really like them. The packaging is so gorgeous. And even, like, the boxes and stuff are so gorgeous. So, yeah, if you'd like me to look at first impressions or anything on all this stuff, once I've used it, then let me know. Um, but I just, yeah, I'm really, really loving it right now. It's made my day a lot better. Guys, I'm actually starting to feel slightly better. And it's literally the best feeling ever. It's 20 past three on Tuesday. Um, and I literally... I, starting to feel a bit more human like i feel like i can actually do things i'm really contemplating going to mcdonald's and getting some lunch um just because i'm actually feeling hungry like yesterday i literally didn't eat i had that pass with tuna and that is the whole the only thing i ate all day i didn't have any dinner whereas i'm actually hungry now so i think i'm i'm tempted to just put some actual clothes on or even just put a coat over my pajamas 
get in my car and go to McDonald's um, and just go and get myself a cheeseburger and chips because I haven't got any food and I haven't got enough energy to go like food shopping or anything. But McDonald's is literally 10 minutes or 5 10 minutes away. Um, and then I could just go and get myself a McDonald's and then come back. And I'm actually I'm watching a new series on Netflix. I'm watching a series called Love and it's just come out like a couple of weeks ago, like a week ago on Netflix. Um, and it's like a Netflix original series and I'm really enjoying it. I'm just started episode three and i just really like it it's really good hey guys um it's tuesday evening it's like nine o'clock um and my friends went and brought me some more medicine they got me some of these which are the sudafed mucus relief triple action cold and flu tablets um so i've just had some of these um i've just had some more cavonia as well I've nearly finished the whole, like, what do you call it, bottle of Cavornia. Um, so I'm going to need some more if this doesn't, like, go by tomorrow night. Because I feel like it has made a difference. I to start with it didn't, but I feel like it has made a difference. Um, but, yeah, it's like five to nine. I do feel a lot better than yesterday. Like, I've just got a lot more energy. Like, I'm not quite as tired. Um, but, like, this time yesterday I was falling asleep, like... Whereas I'm not quite sad. I will go to bed in the next hour, but like, like to sleep. Um, since I've been in bed for like the past three days. Um, but I'm not quite as like tired and sleepy and stuff. So that's really good. I'm just watching Alfie's vlog. I'm going to end this vlog in a second, but I'm just watching Alfie's vlog. Um, because I watched like loads of them yesterday. I've literally, I've just been in bed doing nothing for like so long that I just need stuff to watch. And I haven't watched him in ages. I thought, oh, I'll give him a go. Just watching it. And bless him, I feel really sorry for him. He's like having to really run and like clear things up about the fact that he didn't vlog, um, on Zoe's dad's birthday. Um, because it was his birthday he wanted to celebrate with him and um there's just been like outrage on twitter apparently about the fact that he didn't vlog and i'm like jesus christ some people just need to chill out don't they like to, to not vlog like just no, no for people to moan at him for not vlogging for one day like is your life that depend on alfie's vlogs for one day like i don't know just i just think it's ridiculous anyway um so yeah i feel really sorry for him so i'm just sat there here watching that um and that is about it really i watched the whole season of that love um series that i was talking about earlier it's really good really really good not something you'd expect but um if you're looking for something to watch it's kind of light-hearted but quite it's not particularly gripping i wouldn't say but light-hearted just slightly funny just nice lovey thing then yeah i'd watch it i've really enjoyed it um i've watched the whole season there was 10 episodes um and i never ever ever do that i cannot remember the last time i watched a whole season in a day like i just can't so it's really refreshing to just sit there and be like look at all this time i have even though i really would appreciate being able to get up and actually do something productive rather than watch a whole season of a series but it was really good so if you're looking for something to watch i would definitely recommend that um but uh, yeah so i am feeling better i'm gonna end the vlog here i'm really really sorry that the vlog hasn't been very long um i edited it edited most of it earlier and realized that it really hasn't been long at all so i'm really sorry about that um but obviously it's just because i've been poorly for like the past four days or so and so i don't know i just obviously haven't vlogged as much um because basically i've just looked like this and it's not particularly very pleasing um for me to edit or for you guys to watch so yeah i really really appreciate you guys watching and stuff so please subscribe if you haven't already the button is always down below and i will speak to you on friday if there's no video up on friday because i'm too ill because the only time really i'd have to film it would be tomorrow and I probably don't feel very well. So if there's no video on Friday, then I will see you on Monday. So thank you very much for watching, and I will speak to you next time. Bye! If you'd like to watch some more of my videos, then on the left here, I have a products not worth the hype video, where I kind of show you um, lots of products that have had loads of hype and attention around them that I don't particularly like. Um, so if you'd like some different opinions on some products, then go and watch that one. And on the right here, I have my latest weekly vlog from the week before this one, where I'm not quite as coldy, so go and watch that if you want a less ill person vlog. Um, and then I also upload new videos every Monday, Wednesday and Friday, so be sure to subscribe to watch those.